on Fox and Friends, that when Hillary Clinton became Secretary of State in 2009, there were concerns about money being paid through the foundation, especially the millions of dollars coming into the foundation from Russia. The Clinton Foundation was a vehicle in many ways, for foreign nationals and foreign governments to influence the Secretary of State. You know, there's evidence you had a bunch of Russian money, millions of dollars in Russia money, flow into the foundation and into the personal coffers of the Clintons in order to guarantee a positive result on Uranium One. Where is this Justice Department? They're investigating the, 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 the uh, specious Russia collusion uh, allegations against uh, the Trump campaign, uh, but the Russia influence operation that benefited the Clintons uh, directly and personally, mm -hmm. a wall. And you had ties to Russian banks with the Podesta brothers, correct? Oh, sure. You had uh, uh, Tony Podesta, who was working with Manafort, <clears throat> which is a separate issue. And then um, uh, Mr. Podesta, John Podesta, who was close to Mrs. Clinton, had business relationships with the Russians as well. But uh, as I said, this Justice Department, uh, whether it be the deep state or whatever, it's all about getting President Trump and protecting Hillary Clinton. And it's about time this Clinton Foundation come up for review. And I'm glad this hearing took place because most Americans don't know about this uh, corruption that's been uncovered as it relates to the Clintons. Uh, we had uh, these two other uh, witnesses yesterday testify. I listened to their testimony. They've talked to insiders at the Clinton Foundation that have concerns. And one of the conclusions I drew and the conclusions they drew was that maybe the Clinton Foundation should have been registered under the Foreign Agents Registration Act, which again is being used to target and harass President Trump and his team. But again, the Clintons get a pass. So they and were so not registered. They were not, but they were acting on behalf of foreign uh, mm -hmm. governments, it looks like. And uh, Rich raises questions about whether the law should have applied to them. You know, Meadows also told Fox News that three people had turned over hundreds of pages of evidence of potential wrongdoing by the foundation, including misappropriation of funds and allegations of quid pro quo promises made to donors during Clinton's tenure as Secretary of State.